What's up y'all, it's T-Dub. I'm here with another YouTube video trying to be somewhat helpful to our little community we have going on here. Uh, I play Marvel Strike Force and I like to enjoy my game at as most frames as my computer can pump out. Well, in doing so, I play mobile games and therefore I use Bluestacks. Well, Bluestacks is very temperamental when it comes to giving you, in my opinion, an adequate amount of frames and for some reason it limits you. Now, with a few, few tricks, I can get you triple digit numbers. Let's go ahead and go straight into it. When I load up my game, I'm stuck here at 29 frames per second or 30. I have a right about there. You know, unfortunately, that is not good enough for me. I'm not interested in 30 frames. That's not how I want to enjoy my gaming experience. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and close out my game. So I've closed my game and now you see I have a couple other games and this works for for any other game and not just Marvel Strike Force. We go into our settings. Now look, I, I'll show you my settings but this is not what's most important. I'm going to show you the things that are important and then we'll and then you can do whatever settings that's best for your computer. I personally do four and four and then OpenGL is key. You know, your DirectX to me seems more for um, like Fortnite or some, you know, big time game. You know, we're, we're playing a mobile game here and I believe OpenGL is probably just fine. And for me, it actually, ha it's mandatory for this to work. So OpenGL is the other. Now, I, you see I have my frame set pretty high, but unfortunately the, it's not responding. Bluestacks is not responding. So what we're going to do. We're going to lower our frames to 30. Now, whatever yours was at before, that's fine. You just lower it to 30. If it was at 60, you lower it to 30. You disable enable high frame rates. <clears throat> you click on save. Now, we're going to close this, and we're going to close this instance completely of Bluestacks. That's also the key. You have to completely close the instance, and then what you can do is reopen your instance here, which we're doing now. And now that we've restarted our instance, and you can have several instances going at a time and do this at instance specific. So now we go ahead and load up our game of choice, which for myself right now, I'm enjoying Marvel Strike Force. It has its ups and downs. Right now, more downs than ups, but that's okay. I'm keeping my chin up, and hopefully things get a little bit better. All things being equal, I do want to bring this to you because it has enjoyed my gaming experience quite a bit. Therefore, I want all of you to enjoy your gaming experience, maybe a little bit more than you are currently. And to me, more frames is the way to do it. Also, if I could just... As we go over what we need to do here, look at me, I'm T-Dub, right there. You see I've opened all my orbs, but that's all right. So now the game is loaded. We're, we feel pretty good. We go to our settings, we click on engine, and then we are going to enable high frame rates. And then we're gonna slide it all the way to 240, we're gonna click save, and we're going to watch our, our frames rocket. As you see here, we're at 233, 234, 236, 229. Now, also our game looks a lot more clear, a lot more clear. This is a much enjoyable experience. So let's go ahead and maximize this and see how our frames kind of hold up. Now, each computer is gonna be a bit different and that's okay, that's fine. Each experience, you know, <clears throat> when I start playing, my frames are going to drop. But that's okay. We're going to go ahead and do a, a little demonstration. And look, everything looks a lot more crisp, a lot more smooth. That is a completely different experience than I am used to when, I, when I'm playing this game. This looks great. I'm not going to lie. This looks great. I'm now excited. I have another game up on... Uh, I'm excited to try with all the games that I play. 
So let's give a quick demonstration. I want to see now in action. So I'm holding at like 230 right now, but this is just the, the normal game screen. So we will do a an arena attack, and I'm ranked fourth. And we'll see if we can find now. <laughs> This is the number one ranked team, and that's fine, and I can take them out. I don't usually like to fight the number one guy until the end, but we will, for this video, go ahead and give it a go. We will go ahead and see if my normal cast of characters can get this done. Now, as we watch our frames, we dip down, but it's loading. So now we're back at 161, 183. Now, I was capped at 30. I was capped at 30. And that is totally fine. And now we need to make some decisions. But this game looks great. Already, how the people are moving, twice as good as before. Twice as good as before. So what we're going to do here is we are going to... Ability blocks certain people and then try to eliminate the others. But what I'm watching are my frames. So right there, look, it dips down. It dips down. You know, my computer can handle what it can handle. Now I'm at 119 and it probably will dip down to 100. But I can tell you what, this looks significantly better than it did. Significantly better. And I've played on 30 frames for months absolutely months and this today is by far the best i've ever seen my game play you know and i'm very happy for that i want i want high high gameplay visualization to me this has made the game so much more fun just in a short amount of time and as we watch our frames, we well, drop down to 88, 89, you know, 70s. And But the one thing we will get to see is that it will increase over time, which is going to be very nice. And just the whole gameplay experience is that much nicer. <clears throat> it looks like we're doing okay on our war attack. Hopefully we... We will win this here, or my arena attack. Now, <clears throat> you might see me quit this game because I don't want to be at number one in the arena until the end of the day. But what I do want to show you is, you know, Silver Surfer, he's graphically hurts games. You know, for us, it hurts games. But, you know, 86, 88 holding frames strong, that's a lot better than 30. And you see how he's moving around? This is great. This is great. I absolutely love this. So we're going to... Oh, no, I won. Well, I'll... that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> that's okay. It had 230 frames, though. Look, but the game experience, everything looks better and brighter, which is really, really nice. We are <clears throat> now. I do want to show one other game very quick so that it does what happens when we switch games. That's what I want to show you. What happens? Are we going to be capped? Oh, obviously, I've been playing quite a bit. Th this game was great when it first came out, and I'm enjoying it a lot, but I haven't had time to play it the last few days. Now, <clears throat> to help me test this game, I'm going to bring on my son, Little Dub, and he's going to demonstrate how to play. This is Little Dub right here. Hello. Say hello, YouTube world. What's going on? I see that this game is swiftly downloading. No technical issues at all. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Oh, there we go. Hit, go ahead yep. and hit play, sir. Hit play. Now, we're, what we're testing is that do we get to continue with our good frames? And how about you sit with me? And let's see if we get good frames. All right. Click OK. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to show that this fix works across all games, which is great. It looks like we're holding our frames right there. That is absolutely wonderful. Let's see some gameplay real quick here. Click on dual mode. We're just going to do a quick do ranked battle. 
we have a black, just click OK. I don't know if this deck is going to be good or not. Here, go ahead and maximize the screen. Let's get maximum use here. I am going to kind of, maybe I should play, or do you want to have a go? No, you can play. Okay, I am going to try to play with one hand, and we'll see, maybe actually, I'll try for real. We don't want to. We don't want to lose. Look, we just won one game. We don't want to lose our next game. But holy cow! Look at this, though. You know, I did not get a favorable starting position, right here. But that's okay. He did put acceleration up, which is going to be a problem. But we did get a nice heal in. And so what we're going to do is we're going to AOE also his back line, and we're going to go ahead and play the AOE game if that's what he wants to do. And we're going to go ahead, look, we're going to lose this unit anyways, which is fine. Actually, that's probably not fine. And we are going to continue with our AoEs. We're going to play the AoE game. Same thing, more AoE damage on these guys. Even though it looks like they just purified all of our spells, and so that is really good. Uh, I also want to let you know that we are losing this fight. And that's okay, because we're still watching our frames hovering around 97, 100. This is absolutely amazing. This looks great. This looks absolutely great. And they keep cleansing all of our AoE spells, so I just want to let you know that it's also really great. So we are... I, I still think we're losing this match, but we're losing it with 147 frames, which is absolutely wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. See, we definitely did the wrong spell right there, but that's okay. That's okay. We're going to hopefully and get lucky, which we are not, but that's also fine. And we're going to cleanse ourselves and heal ourselves. We see that their back line is still kind of hurting. Oh. And we just totally got yeeted, which is nice. And we're hopefully can kill everybody by doing all these AoE spells. And we're going to try to counter attack. And yes, still AoEing their entire team while they're trying to destroy us. Now, that guy is totally toast. And we're still going to AoE everybody. And we have two powerful characters left. But I think that... Oops, we're going to stun this guy. We did not stun him quick enough. Still at 139 frames, though. Can you believe this? No, you can't. Okay, we're going to lose this game. But what we wanted to show here to, to YouTube land is that we got 178 frames through this match. And unfortunately, we did not win, but that's okay. I want to say thank you to everybody out there in YouTube land. We are enjoying our 158 frames after being capped at 30 for over a month. So thank you guys so much for showing up. Say goodbye, Little Dub. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Goodbye. And if you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave it there. Also hit the like and subscribe. Is that, is that what we say? Yes. Like and subscribe. All right. Thank you guys so much. Have a great day. And we will talk to you soon. Peace. Bye-bye.